It's the changing of the guards for the 3rd Army at Shaw Air Force Base. Lieutenant General Vincent Brooks handing over control to Lieutenant General James Terry. Lieutenant General James Terry is a war fighter of the first order with incredibly deep experience in combat. Terry most recently served as Deputy Commanding General of U.S. Forces in Afghanistan. He also assumed command of the International Security Assistance Force. Hundreds were on hand for Tuesday morning's command change ceremony. Uh, I think we have to focus a lot on engaging with our regional partners out there to, to create uh, conditions for greater stability. Mm -hmm. That's going to be primarily our focus. On a national level, he talked about the removal of troops from Afghanistan come February. Right now, we'll pull down about uh, 34,000 uh, U.S. soldiers, sailors, airmen, and Marines. What that entails then is not just the, the, uh, the movement of the personnel back, it also entails the retrograde of the equipment. Lieutenant General Brooks's new promotion is sending him to Hawaii. He thanks his Sumter military family in part for that success. And while I will have a new opportunity to command with a promotion to the rank of four-star general, it's absolutely clear to me that we earned that together. I get to wear it, you get to share it. As for the new man in charge, Lieutenant General Terry seems to have a good sense of humor. He joked about SEC football. And it might be a house divided when Georgia plays South Carolina, <laughs> but it will be a house united against Alabama, Florida, Tennessee, and all those other <laughs> SEC teams out there. Go dogs! Cool. Cool. At Shaw Air Force Base, Freddie Clairvaux, Watch Fox News.